Hey guys, Chris Meets with Icon Ecom here. Today we're going to take a few minutes and go over how to update your account so that you are charged for a calculated shipping rate. So you now have the choice if you want to use our flat rate shipping option or if you want to upgrade your account to use the calculated rates. Uh, so we'll be going through how to set that up today. So if you come over to the account section over here on the left and scroll down here under billing info, you'll see uh, there's a checkbox here for bill using calculated shipping. So if this box is checked, it'll use the calculated rates whenever an order comes in and we invoice your credit card. Uh, if you have this unchecked, then we'll use the flat rate shipping options. So to see what that kind of looks like, you can come over here to your product section and then go to coffee mugs. Uh, and, and this will show up on any of the products. You can see here we have our flat rate shipping options uh, displayed uh, for domestic and international. If we come in here to shipping info, uh, we show what the shipping weight is and shipping dimensions for each of the product sizes. Um, and if you come in here and put in a zip code and click on get estimate, it'll show you the estimated shipping cost for that one item. So this is a 15 ounce uh, coffee mug. I will ship uh, your cost for $8.65. Um, so that's kind of get to get an idea of what pricing will show up on your invoices compared to our flat rate shipping options. Um, if you want to see for multiple items, what you can do is come over here to the order section and go into create manual order. Uh, we'll add a couple items to my order here. And you can see now we have a get estimate section here. So if I come down here and put in a zip code down here and again, click on the get estimate, you'll see my estimate for the order for both items is 884. Uh, so we're hoping this will help you guys out a lot, uh, especially to be able to help with the you know, getting multiple items um, on a single order. In the next videos, we'll go over how you can update your different platforms, uh, whether you're selling on WooCommerce or Shopify or Etsy, uh, on how you can set up those platforms to uh, actually be able to charge these calculated rates um, so you can charge that uh, on your uh, shopping cart or sales platform as well. So those will be in the next videos.